Hey, what's up, guys? Your boy DJ Eno. Just showing you a quick um, tutorial of something I saw on another YouTuber's channel, which actually works. Um, I'm pretty happy with it. It's about a dragon that had to keep him away from getting skinny. My dragon that is not skinny, but I don't want him to go skinny because my cocoa pots are not established fully yet. So we have a hotel of cocoa pots. Is that what we're gonna name it now? It's just like a container, small, so whatever you can find. Poke some holes all around each side. Just put some shadow in there, and you'll see the cold pots go in there and have um, a safe place to reproduce. I don't know if you guys could see or not, but I do have a good amount of them in there. And then, yeah, they'll, they'll, they'll get out whenever they want, go into the rocks. And then we'll have the dragon light go around and eat them. Sometimes the shrimp, the clownfish, the Wyoming, they'll go after them as well. Not necessarily because I do feed them some mice and shrimp. But my dragon uh, is not trained yet to eat frozen food. So I don't want him to starve to death. Which he has eaten frozen food when he wants to. And then he just doesn't want to another day. Pretty weird. I know. Anyways. I, the only reason I put this is because my when it goes to my overflow, it won't survive the copa pots because it will end up in this filter. And then there's another filter you probably can't see it from up from right here, this black one, and then this one, and then I customized this wet and dry and made a sump also, add some chambers, and then I have my little protein skimmer that I got from Coral Life. It's only like $30, I believe. I got it off eBay. It was cheaper. I paid like $10, honestly. And it's working fine. Um, do have a couple pieces of rock, more Shido. I just have a small little light. Just for the Shido. Um, there is Cobalt Pots in there. But as far as they were producing, I'm not sure. I mean, I do see a good amount more. So if they really wanted to just go return pop back up. But if they are not, then that means there is nothing going up here. Which you could probably see some like on the glass on that side. But that's from when I had restocked. Um, probably can't see them right now. They probably all went away. But I have this little guy. This is the main video. If you want to keep your dragon eye nice and full. Oh, I can't see my little guy. Where is he? He's going around somewhere. So everything looks pretty like still asleep. I just turned on the lights not so long ago. I have um hang on the, I just hang it off the wall. I didn't want to do that. It's not a bad idea. It actually works, it's pretty cool. You can just add a shelf up there and add stuff if you wanted to. It's a smart and expensive idea. Bought on my these like the L's at Walmart for like what was it like four dollars each one which is not bad at all and it actually works where's my dragon at it he's hiding somewhere oh there he is probably can't see him he likes to hide oh there he goes there he goes eating away I actually like when he comes on top of this rock and um he stands he usually likes to hang out there for a bit before he goes on his adventures like i said everything looks <laughs> like if it was dying but i just turned out the lights not so long ago and i have frags i don't have this thing running for a really really long time and i moved my stuff from another tank so oh here you go Come out, little guy. Come out. Come out. Everybody wants to see you. There we go. That's my dragon. Net. He's still a baby. He's not that big. But yeah. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Peace.